Oh, uh, before we get there, I should I should probably mention that. <laughs> <laughs> oh God, who's that? That's so. There's this girl, Nona. She's just this girl, and I'm totally into her, and I want her to be into me. So just you know, j- just be cool, okay? No pouting or complaining or anything. All right? Deal. Be cool. Don't be like just how you can be sometimes. Oh, what was the thing you wanted to say to Alex Jonas? You can just pretend I'm like a stray dog and can't understand. Uh, yeah, what was it really, Jonas? If you have some deep dark secret, I'd like to know now before we're Reginald. I hear you over there. Hey, guys. Wait, I was saying, I was about to tell a story. What was it? About Brad's car. Oh well, that can wait. Hey. We started a fire down the way, but Nona wanted to play beach nanny, so. Uh, yeah. Everyone, this is Jonas. Jonas, everyone. Hey. Hi. And Jonas, that's who are you again? Jonas. Jonas. He's Alex's new in town, fresh as the daisy stepbrother. Stepbrother. Really? Yeah, I know. It's a trick. Yeah, you think he'd be a little old to need a babysitter, but here we are. <laughs> yeah, if I don't have anyone to burp me, it becomes a real issue. Wait, 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 wait. You're Jonas. Jonas, the stepbrother. Yeah. Um, what's your name again? That is Clarissa. How but she's... are you her stepbrother? Like, what does that even mean? Um... My mom married his dad, so family, law, and all. Yeah, well, I guess this is happening now. This is a thing that is happening, so... <sighs> Where is everyone else? Nicole had that tennis thing. And? Clarissa, we... <laughs> we took the last ferry. I thought more would show up, but... <laughs> oh my god, it's just Alex and her new stepbrother? <laughs> That's... That's it. That's who you brought. That's the group. Ugh, come on, Clarissa. I'm fun. I'm hip. I'm with it. Listen to yourself. Wait, aren't you all, like, friends? I'm friends with Nona, and I'm downgrading Ren to, like, a creepy neighbor. And you I just met. <laughs> hey, yeah. what about me? What about you? Just never mind. You see, Jonas, normally this is like a 20-deep rager, but Pat had a party last weekend, and... Fire! Man's great equalizer. So, what's the, um, what's the, like, thing to do here? Other than obviously go skinny dipping and get murdered by Jason Kruger. Yeah, let's just get drunk. It's supposed to be a party, right? Hey, where does that old woman live? Oh, you mean Maggie Adler? Yeah. Nowhere. She's dead. What? Yep, killed over three days ago. It was all over the news. Local news, anyway. Oldest living resident. Hey, we could go see her house. It must be huge. She was rich as a... No, we can't see her house. There's a giant fence, and I don't want to tear my jeans trying to climb it. And to answer your previous question, Jonas, the thing to do is lay on the beach and drink till you can't remember where you are. And sometimes play truth or slap. Yeah, let's play that. We can inaugurate Jonas. Ease him into the night's festivities. Truth or slap? What's that? We used to call it hippo, until we got tired of people asking, why is it called hippo? Because you get to yell, you're a dirty hippo, before you slap someone. You get asked a question. You have to tell the truth, but if somebody can prove that you lied, the accuser gets to slap you. It's a good, uh, getting to know somebody game. Yeah, fun. An excuse to hit run. Hey, I'm the truthiest truth who ever...
truth. All uh. right, let's just get on with it. Okay. So, first, we're gonna. I'll start. Ren. Uh huh. Come on, fess up. You want to go out with Nona, right? Clarissa. Wait, wait, wait. I want to hear his answer. Uh. Oh man, you're good at this. Well, if being good means being kind of mean about it. Look, it's tough to gauge. Uh, something like... Enough stalling. I know you want to sample the goods, now just say no. so. I, I mean, I, I, I like her as a friend, right? That's... I just like her as a friend. That's... that's all. She's cool. She's... She... Oh, liar? Liar! He's lying! He totally likes her! What? Alex, come on, what are you doing? <laughs> I knew it. You can practically smell... <laughs> I'm kidding. Relax. Last I heard, he's still pining for Lindsay, his secret Canadian girlfriend. Yeah, well, I have a thing for hockey, so... Sure. Okay, it's Ren's turn, right? He gets to ask somebody something? Alex, Alex, Alex! <laughs> Uh-oh. I just have to think <laughs> about which nerve I want to so delicately pinch. Okay, uh, just take it easy, all right? Tis all in good fun. Hey, no partnering up to be pansies. Silence! Okay, Mary Screw Kill. Me, Nona, and Clarissa. Why? <laughs> it's fun. It's funny, I don't know. And Jonas is family now, technically, so he's excluded. Well, I'd marry Nona. I like the quiet types. I'm flattered, I think. <laughs> okay, you're going down the line. I do, Ren. We know each other the best, so it'd be like less weird. And you're in a band. Yeah! I knew those bass lessons would come in handy. Which, of course, means that you'd strangle Clarissa in her sleep if you ever got the chance. What a shocker. <laughs> She got what was coming to her. Yeah, I mean, you did shove her into the community pool in sixth grade. <laughs> I did, didn't I? I was a hilarious kid. So, Alex's turn? Yep, lady's choice. Alex gets to pick who to ask something of. Oh, great, here we go. What's your... Uh, Jonas. <laughs> yeah? Tell the truth. How do you really feel about your dad marrying my mom and the fact that we're now de facto organ donors? Well, unless you turn out to be crazier than you look. That'd be hard. I think it's fine. Only known her one night and is already fine with it. What a guy. Is it my question now, then? Yep. Okay, Clarissa, um, last person you made out with. Oh, uh, uh, maybe something else. Or, yeah, maybe, who's the last person you, uh, hugged instead? Uh, what's the matter? It's an honest question. Oh, will you all relax? I've made out with people since... God. Anyways, um, that would have to be Ryan Fisher, two weeks ago in Iggy's Den. I knew it. Yeah, well, he was there, and I was tired. Clarissa's turn now. Alex. You got a new brother. Pretty exciting. I'm sure Jonas is excited, or maybe excited isn't the right word. Maybe a little overwhelmed with just everything, you know? Unsure. It's a lot to take in and adjust to. I'm, um, fine with it, really. Is there, like, well, a question Well, as kind as you can be what? anyway, right? I'm just saying what Jonas is already thinking. That statistics show if you get divorced once, you're probably going to get divorced again... And the fact is, your mom divorced your dad, so... Let's put his mind at ease and hear why. Okay, uh, just get to whatever point this is getting to. The point is, why'd your parents get a divorce? Oh, what? You're just gonna walk away? For your own sake, you should be happy I'm walking away. We're stopping until you come back here.
Silence counts as a lie, Alex. My brother Michael died and it broke everything and they couldn't handle it. The end. Well, now you know, Jonas. Don't die and everything will be fine. Okay, Clarissa, you... What? You know, guys, honestly, I think I'm pretty much ready to do anything else besides this game. Wait, let's... Let's not stop like this. We should, like... Game's over, Ren. I won. And to celebrate, I'm gonna sit on the beach and drink and maybe, if I'm feeling spicy, even take a nap. Maybe we could get... And that's exactly what Nona's gonna do, too. Oh my god, you are annoying. This isn't me being annoying. This is me being tired. There's a difference. Cheese! If you guys in your scavenger hunt or playing Ring Around the Rosy happen to find anything more interesting than a slowly dying starfish, you be sure to just let me know. Super. <sighs> Whatever. Well, I want to inaugurate this bitch by checking out the caves. Nona, want to come? Uh, I mean, I would, but... I'm very clingy, Ren. <sighs> Fine. Jonas, you're a strapping young lad. Help boost me over the fence. The cave's just, uh, yonder. And I guess you expect me to just jump over after? But like I said, you're a strapping young lad. Okay, come on. Where are you from again? It's a small town near North Valley. Oh yeah, is it nice? If you like bars on the windows. Alex, you want to check out the caves, or...? Yeah, let's do it. Boost me up? Yeah, come on. Come on, <laughs> I'll push you over. Oh, oh, I forgot. We never talked about Whenever John. Whenever you're ready. Oh, what, their date? So, the cave. What's your bets? On a scale of 1 to 10, how weird's it gonna be? Probably a five? Weird enough to remember, but not weird enough to tell anybody about it after. <laughs> All right. Hey, Chris seems to be her normal annoying self. Sorry about that. Yeah, Ren, about Nona. What? Did she say anything? Because if she said anything, you should tell me. Like, word for word. Maybe you should just... Give her a little space, you know? Really? I thought you girls liked to be pursued. Uh, no. You should play a little hard to get. Aloof. Mysterious. Oh, alright. I see where your head's at. Now, who's ready to have their minds blown? If you don't mean that literally. Me, me, me. Oh, wait. Actually, I almost forgot gonna take a little magic trip to Cupcake Town. Those look like brownies. Magic? What does that mean? It means they're enhanced with certain qualities. Hmm. Well, maybe just don't eat too much. No promises. Hmm. Delicious. Okay, so see these little piles of rocks? The kids before us always leave them here, so you know where to try and tune in the signals. So you're going to want to stand basically right around here. And just tune the dial left or right until you start hearing some weirdness. How will we know when it's... You'll know. Trust me. So just pull out your radio... Any day. Holy crap! Wow, it's even cooler than I thought it would be. What is it? What's doing it? Maybe the tuning's like unblocking a weather balloon or something? <laughs> it doesn't make any sense. Well, it's just crazy, then, because I don't know. 
If you move around, it kind of changes too, I think. Like, over at this pile. Here, come over here and try it. This is so cool. I know! Clarissa and Nona should see this, right? I mean, I know it's like weird with you guys or whatever for some reason, but... They... they're fine where they are. Okay, just what is Clarissa's issue with you two? She dated Michael for five seconds like three years ago. It was for a couple of months a year and a half ago. She should just seriously get over it already. Clarissa's the kind of person who doesn't feel full unless she's pissed at somebody, so... Whew. Brownies are kicking in. Did that make sense? Yeah, it did to me. Okay, good. Now, there's another cool spot, I think, over here. Bring it on over. So, yeah, it sounds, uh... It sounds, like, painful. Yeah. Wait, what was that? There's like, this is gonna sound stupid, but there's like something in here. Famous last words. Famous last words. I called it. No, I see it too. I'm sure there is something in there, like a giant rabies-filled bat, or a maniac who wears mannequin wigs. Or it kind of looks like a pool or something. 
Like a freshwater one, maybe. Let's check it out. It's not that far in. <laughs> if it's a pool, that'd be cool. I, um, didn't mean that to rhyme. <laughs> cool pool. Fortune favors the bold. <laughs> Bye. Wait a minute! Jonas! Well, I am going to just rest against here. Because I think... Shh, I think I've mismeasured the magic. <laughs> <laughs>